Hi, I'm Rich from Hometown Auto Repair and Tire. Here today to talk to you about the Virginia Safety Inspection as well as the Virginia State Emissions Inspection. So you've just moved to Virginia. What do you need to do to register your car? Well, the first thing you need to get is the Virginia Safety Inspection. That's the sticker you see in your window. Um, that's related to safety items. It's uh, regulated by the Virginia State Police. They're going to look for tires, steering, suspension, hundreds of items in your car to make sure that those items are working properly and are safe to be operated on the roads. The second item you're going to need is called the Virginia Emissions Inspection. So your Virginia plates come from DMV. The Virginia Emissions Inspection is put together by the Department of Environmental Quality. That's, those inspections are conducted at various places in the, uh, in the area. Um, they must be state police and must be emissions um, licensed to perform those inspections. So with related to the Virginia safety inspection, that's done every year at prior to the end of the month that's currently on the sticker. The Virginia emissions inspection is conducted every two years. So one of the things we also want to clear up is for our military folks is we have a local, couple local bases and we did check with one of the local bases here to clarify what the military folks may need. First off, you coming from your home state, wherever that may be, you may have your vehicle still registered there and that's perfectly legal. However, if your home state requires some sort of safety inspection and then that inspection has expired on your windshield, Quantico, which is the base we, we contacted, requires you to have a current safety inspection. Well, you can use the Virginia safety inspection to qualify to still get on base. Um, one of the items that I do want to cover is if you have a safety item that does not pass Virginia safety inspection, you may get, you may be offered a rejection sticker. I want to kind of clear that a little bit is you have 15 days to make those repairs and then you can come back to the original inspection station to have that reinspection performed. And so as we talk about the safety inspection, um, it's important to understand that those rules can change on a yearly basis. Uh, we do our best to keep up on those rules. There is a Virginia State Police website to help you understand some of those rules, but that can be confusing. So please ask your service advisor if you have any questions prior to these inspections being conformed. Thank you.